Hello, Star Wars. This is Walter Scandal North. This is the CBC of Walter Scandal North. The area of interest is the upper left first molar for crack evaluation. Now, when you look at the crown structure, we can see a crack extending from the mesial um, all the way to the dist uh, from the mesial all the way to the distal aspect. When we move further down towards the chamber, um, this is the same area where we can see a very clear crack, crack line extending from the pulp chamber mesially and from the pulp chamber distally. And you can see um, we've highlighted with our um, red arrows here. I'm going to zoom in for the doctor as well. Now, when we move further down as um, towards the apex, we can also see that there is a slight crack line right here. So this is in the same area and it's extending right here as well. And along with this, we see PDL widening here, something which is um, confirmatory when it comes to um, the uh, crack extending in the crustal areas of the bony regions. Along with that, along with that, we can also see that this is the palatal root here, and there is a huge periapical radiolucency associated with the palatal root, um, and that is very evident right here as well. Um, so this tooth has a periapical infection. Along with that, it has a crack line. Um, the Width, ridge width is 14 millimeters, whereas the height in this region is 8.4 millimeters. Also of note is the fact that there is an opening in the sinus floor, which is causing this immense sinusitis in this tool, and the sinusitis is definitely odontogenic in its nature. Thank you very much.